Hello guys and welcome to a new crypto video of the most beautiful music instrument there is the crypto violin guys I hope you have an amazing day I'm in the car with my beautiful wife and cinnamon and we're driving to my parents it's my dad's birthday and it has been a long time uh, since I made a new video as you all know I'm extremely bullish and it's very difficult those times but uh, well, I accumulated lots of XRP and I will continue to accumulate and I'm gonna talk about this uh, I'm not gonna make a video now, but in the evening I'm gonna upload a video and this will be my intro. I hope you're all in good health I hope you stay and remain bullish. I've never been more bullish uh, before uh, XRP is a very good project very good crypto um, I know what I own and uh, Ripple the company is continuously building so I don't worry a single bit. I uh, placed some buy orders at 25 cents um, and I'm gonna buy back around uh, approximately 50k worth of XRP at 25 cents and uh, I urge you to uh, play both sides of the market so if you have some capital left just uh, buy don't worry because in the long term it will grow a lot and of course my wife is laughing because she bought a lot it was uh, she was very rich one day and now everything is down 80% but uh, well that's how uh, how things go in the crypto violin family we all invested we invested heavily even cinnamon invested uh, lots of her uh, Lots of her money that she got from us, her pocket money in XRP. Don't worry, Cinnamon. Everything will be fine. I hope you like this video. Before we dive into the Jusimbo content, please don't forget to like, subscribe. I was over 25k subscribers, and you're you're totally right because I didn't make a video for approximately two weeks. I lost 100 subscribers. Guys, where are you going? Don't go anywhere. I'm here. I will stay here. I will remain here until we hit those $10, $20, $100. I'm not going anywhere. I hope you liked the video. Without further ado, let's dive into the Juicy Morish Content I have for you today. Hello guys, so let's dive into the video. I hope you like my intro that I recorded with my new GoPro. Well guys, let's look at the XRP USD pair on the Kraken Exchange. Well, look at what we have here. I draw two trend lines. One that started from uh, March 2020. That was uh, the 11 cents. Then first the 27 cents from December 20th. And now I'm actually waiting for 26 cents. We didn't quite hit this. So there is a possibility guys that we go down one more time and then skyrocket out of here which i think will happen and then it's the question can we break this trend the upwards trend that we broke down of can we break it or will we retest it and confirm that we were actually in a downwards trend there are two possibilities we can break out of here retest and then skyrocket out of here or we can retest this not make it maybe retest it again and then go down that's that are two possibilities well either way i'm gonna play the market but guys what i'm doing i'm waiting for some juicy buy orders that i placed around here 26 cents 25 cents and i urge you uh, you can also enter the market here but i urge you to not fomo into the market and just keep a calm and very logical uh, state of mind and just enter what you think is best and not at these prices here we have to enter here at the retests of support and then maybe exit here and then maybe re-enter when we retest we broke out of here or retest or maybe re-enter when we retest and cannot break above this or may maybe exit and not enter at all and when we break down enter here again this way 
I'm gonna accumulate more than a couple million XRP. That's my goal. I'm gonna trade my way around this because I waited four or five years in this XRP market and I could have made a fortune by just simply trading the pumps, but I didn't. And of course, this doesn't mean I don't believe in uh, XRP. I believe extremely well that XRP will outperform every other crypto, but it needs a little bit more time. If we look at the Bitcoin pair, we see that we are in a downwards trend. We can have a slight retest or we can retest the 16K first and then retest the 30K. I don't know, maybe again the 20K and then again 25K and then maybe breaking out of here and then we can skyrocket out of here. That sounds the smartest option. Uh, because we have to have a plan guys i realized i didn't have a plan for a couple years i was just accumulating i was just accumulating dollar cost averaging but i need also a trading bag where i'm gonna trade my way around it where i'm gonna trade my way to a couple million xrp and please let me know in the description what you will do are you a trader or are you a holder are you an accumulator what are the prices that you feel comfortable selling i will share those with you also in future videos but i have some posts for you that will keep you bullish and keep you positive and i will try to let you realize what you own by showing you those clips please listen carefully go for it the first one's for you this is Brett Garlinghouse and Ross Lico, IMF's Deputy General Counsel at Singapore Fintech Festival. IMF, do you see IMF holding crypto assets in the future? I did not put that up there. <laughs> Just tell them, Ross, about the XRP. Look at the face of Brett Garlinghouse. Remember, I'm from the legal department. I'm supposed to be very conservative about these things. Um, I don't want to go into great details about Maybe the Maybe I should take what the IMF yeah, is going to no, do. Amazing. They know something. The IMF. Brad Garlinghouse from Ripple, CEO of Ripple, they know something. And it has to do something with XRP. Let's go to the next thing. 99% of the population can never emotionally understand this much. Let's do it which is why they call the wealthy the 1%. And this is a photo of John D. Rockefeller and it is the best quote of him uh, from Words of Wisdom. He said, the way to make money is to buy when blood is running in the streets. And John D. Rockefeller, born in 1939, was the founder of the Standard Oil Company, which at one time controlled 90% of the US oil market. Later it was broken into 34 companies, with Exxon Mobil and Chevron being the most notable names today. Rockefeller was the richest man of his time. He didn't just amass wealth, but also engaged in many philanthropic activities. He died in 1937. So guys, I hope this will help you realize that this is very healthy and that we should accumulate around these prices and not be scared. We need to be scared when everything is at new all-time highs. We need to be bullish when everybody is scared. Another news that made me extremely happy. Jets XRP will be gone in less than two weeks. He's just upped his daily sales if he continues at that pace. So Jet McCaleb selling around four million dollars a day and here last uh, day 26th of uh, june he sold 7.33 million xrp in one day well in two weeks he's done no more jet mccaleb sales well what will that do to the price of xrp well 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 guys very bullish news last but not least crypto firm ripple takes 6k san francisco in winwood okay even as the cryptocurrency market creators some firms are still inking leases in miami ripple which develops payment protocols and currency exchanges for cryptocurrencies closed the 6500 square foot lease june the first at the gateway at winwood 
the properties developer RMB Reality announced. So San Francisco based Ripple has 15 offices to house 5,000 employees. Its Miami lease is just over five years, said a representative for the developer. The asking rent stood at $75 per square foot. Well guys, do you realize something? Ripple is in a lawsuit with the SEC and they are telling everybody, yeah, if we lose this lawsuit, we will go outside the United States. We will leave the United States in the entirety. Well, guys, guess what? You don't lease a whole building for five years if you're in this lawsuit that you don't see a way out and that you are anticipating to lose. Ripple already won. They know they won. It's going great and a settlement can happen any minute. Guys, I hope I made you bullish. I'm extremely bullish. I hope you feel the bullishness in your veins. Those are the times to accumulate. I am accumulating. I hope you're doing this too. Please like if you like content provide. Subscribe if you want to be updated to new bullish videos. And I hope to see you in the next juicy and bullish video. Have an amazing day. Bye-bye.